If you've ever wondered how to get channel point sound alerts or just sound alerts in general for your Twitch stream, well then look no further because I'm gonna show you the absolute easiest way possible to add them. I will be showing you the sound alerts Twitch extension. Now the way to get this is to go to your creator dashboard on twitch.tv, then scroll down to extensions, go to the search bar, type in sound alerts, press enter, go to sound alerts, now on the right side here, there will be a button called install. Click on that and then it's going to get you to actually configure the extension itself. So then it will bring up this little page right here. Open the sound alerts dashboard. Now click this right here. It will then log you in. And then before we actually implement the browser source or do anything else, we are then going to come over here to the settings. Now it's very important to change the master volume from 100%, which is what it is, when you first get it to about 15 to maybe 20% because if you don't, it's gonna be way too loud for your viewers and it's not gonna be a good time. So then once you do that, you're gonna come down here. The channel points are actually disabled by default. I don't really understand why, but you're gonna click enabled and then you will then save the settings, come up here to the dashboard and then this is when we're actually going to implement the browser source and extension and then manage the sounds. So come down here to the implement browser source. Now I use OBS Studio. In my opinion, it is the superior software compared to Streamlabs OBS, XSplit, Twitch Studio, or even OBS Live using the stream elements. So click on I use OBS Studio and then you can drag and drop the button below in your OBS starting scene. So click that. You just drag that into OBS. It will say, we're about to make a browser source out of this link. Is this okay? Click yes. So after you do that, you can click play test alert. This will bring up a little test alert from test alert. So after you do this, you will then click install extension. Start earning bits with sound alerts. You don't have to set them as a bit amount, but anyway. Install the sound alerts extension on Twitch here. Click install extension. It will then bring you to this page right here. Just go to my extensions, scroll down to where it is. As you see, I have quite a few of them. And then you will click activate. Now, if you are only doing channel point redeems, you don't actually have to have this as a component or as a panel. But if you do want just regular old sound alerts to where people can press on the button, and it will actually make the sound alert play on your stream. I would personally suggest the component as most of my panels are pretty much about me and not about extensions. But yeah, once you set that up and you activate that, if you want those just regular sound alerts, we will then come back over to the dashboard to sound alerts and then go to the library. Now this is where we're actually going to get the sounds that we want. So we will do, let me see here, uh, chicken dance. As you see, I have one already added, but add this sound. Once you click on it, it will give you two options, extension or channel points. You can set the bits that somebody has to have and use in order to play it. Or you can ch uh, check out the channel points right here. Chicken dance remix, 2000 channel points. I would say maybe a thousand, but either way, that's how you do it. You can then come over to the uploads and you can upload your own sounds if you want. Be careful as some stuff will be copyrighted. Just a warning. So guys, I hope this video did help you guys out. If it did, please consider commenting saying, hey, this video helped me out. I'm really gonna use this in the future. And if you could do a tutorial on blank, please do it just to give me, you know, an idea of what people want to see next. And be sure to hit that subscribe button, the notification ding ding, and I will catch you guys in the next video. Peace.